Hello guys, welcome back to another video on my channel and today I'll be showing you how to um, level up your units without using ramen soup so let's say you don't want to grind any soup because you're low on it or um, yeah, you just don't want to waste any of your soup and you're going to be grinding ninja road because of the kage league units you might as well uh, do this so let me get the kage league units on my team first so I do that I think I have four that I need to level up. Um, where are they? Hmm. Let's see, where are they? Where are they? I know Sage Monarto's one. I have Jiraiya, where's Jiraiya's skill? Kagi as well. And Jiraiya, where's Jiraiya? Should be up here somewhere. It's right here. Alright, so you're gonna have to level up your Kage League units, so I might as well uh, do this too. So, like, I've been doing this for a while, like three months, just doing this strategy. And uh, like for units that I, I like don't really use, so I wasn't in a rush to level up, I would level up. So like the units that are, uh, you can limit break with the limit break crystals that you can buy from the shop. So like for example, like this one, I was in the middle of uh, leveling, leveling it up. But uh, let's see, I could choose this Itachi. see what else um obito who needs to love up zabuza all right so i put units that i need to level up like this atachi uh skill obito the four kage league units right there and then all these units and then on this uh, slum I have my team so let me put it right quick um, Crit Hashirama Bravery Kaguya the one with dupes not this one this one and Final Valley Sasuke and Naruto so Sasuke and Naruto and then the uh, OT Naruto for boosting, so let me see where's Naruto. Uh, right here. Not that one. Uh, this one. And then the boosters. Then let me switch these around. Like this. Alright, so I'm gonna be in this team and then. These other two slots are just for leveling up, so let me uh, start the ninja road. Alright, so just do the ninja road however you would do it. For me, um, I'm going to be boosting this team in the first map and then... Uh, and then basically nuking like from the seventh map up. So I'm just gonna boost. Let me get uh, red ring first. So basically the same thing that I did um, on my Ninja Road video. So I just do what I'm normally gonna do. Move there and move that. But yeah, this is the best way if you want to level up units without using any soup or wasting any soup. You could just do this since you're you're gonna be uh, grinding for or for grinding for leveling up your Kage League units. So might as well put other units that you need to level up as well. All right, so I move away. 
move up here, boost again, so 50%. down here. Sasuke is probably gonna kill it. Yep. That's fine though. Ready. I do ninjutsu. Leave one. Alright, so I'm gonna boost again. So yeah, I'm just doing this in the first round so that when I get to the the harder maps like seven, eight, nine, I can just nuke them and go through it fast. I don't have to deal with the status alignments or any of that. So I'm pretty sure one per one hundred percent now. Yep. So. Do that. Oh, I should have boosted. Oh, I forgot. Alright, so let me boost right now. So that's 125 one more time. And then I can go on to the next map and just do this new road fast. So, do that. Do this. But yeah, at the end of this, I'm gonna show you how many soup I have, I have stored because I, I haven't used it in like a long time because I've been using this strategy uh, or this way of grinding the levels for every unit uh, for a while now. And the only reason why I keep doing this is because I have to level up my Kage Elite units either way, so I'm gonna be grinding Ninja Road either way, so might as well uh, bring them. Um, I do this. This should kill. Not sure. Or close to kill. Oh, it kills. All right, nice. 100k ninjutsu. All right. All right. So the fifth map. Uh, I'm just gonna be doing. Ninjutsu and then I'm probably gonna ult with Kaguya Because after um After the sixth boss I get chakra back So it doesn't matter if I use the uh, jutsus right now I am gonna take some damage though Ooh, that's a lot of damage. All right, so oh, and then on the boss, I'm gonna use crit Hashirama to one shot, and then seventh map one shot with Kaguya, and basically just one shot everything. Uh, let's see, Hashirama crit. So I'm gonna get chakra back, so I might as well use it. 280k, nice. So I get chakra back. And then I'm gonna boost. Cause I got chakra, might as well. And then uh, one shot this map. And uh, the eighth boss, I don't think I'm gonna one shot, but I'm gonna do damage. So do the ultra combo. Boost. The thing that sucks about this boss is that he does do a lot of damage, so you have to watch out for that. So right there, he just did like half my health. Which is bad. I'm gonna do this. And then I'm gonna do uh, Hashirama's ninjutsu. 
Hopefully it almost kills or kills it. All right, so I killed it, 88K. So I get uh, double chakra every turn for 10 turns on this, uh, after defeating that boss. So let me boost. And then if I'm able to get, um, yeah, I'm gonna be able to get the, the ult for, um, Hashirama right now, so I'm gonna one shot it. And then on the final map, I'm gonna do Kaguya, which will almost kill it, but not quite. And then I'll use Final Valley Sasuke and Naruto to finish it off. So I put ready. Let me boost. So I get some chakra for crit Hashirama. Alright, so I do ultimate. The secret technique. And it's gonna do like half. Yeah, so like half. Almost kills the Madara. We're gonna do Final Valley Sasuke. So 160k and he's 150 boost and he has a perfect dodge right now so we're good from that attack and then I just need to go to Final Valley um, Naruto and then it's over so Final Valley Naruto this and 50 turns so And then most of most of my units that I had um, that I put to level up were like level one, so you're gonna see that they that their levels are gonna increase like by a lot. So I do this, get the coins, and then like so the ones on top are level one. The one, two on the bottom, Itachi and Obito are level one. They're still leveling up. <laughs> Kagali units take, takes a lot to level up, so they're, they're only gonna level up like once every time you do it. So they're gonna take a long time to grind. So that's why you should just take whoever you need to upgrade and not use your uh, soup. So you could just save it and put it on Ninja Roll if you're not in a rush to level level the units up. Like if you're, you don't think you're gonna use it uh, that much or you don't need it right now, you could just uh, slowly level it up and uh, save your soup for units that you really want to level up like as soon as you get it that way you don't have to keep grinding the the mission the ramen mission so the level fives went all the way up to level 50 the first time so they went from level one to level 50 and then the level six stars went from level one to level 60. And then the Kage League unit, units, I didn't really pay attention, but they usually they go up by one. So it gives you a whole bunch of XP just for doing it. And watch, let me show you, um, let me show you the soup that I have, uh, saved up, because I haven't, I haven't used it in a while. I used it recently for Indra, but that's like pretty much it, and I think 7 star Naruto. But, I have 810 level 3 star soup, heart type. 186 four star soup hard type i just have a whole bunch because i haven't been using them like skill level three soup 735 level four 205 so yeah i have a whole bunch of soup just saved and whenever i'm gonna need it then i know i'm gonna have enough same for the five uh five star ramen i have 68 i've been saving it because if I'm not gonna use the unit, like for the Kage League, I might as well not use it and just slowly level it up through Ninja Road. So I have a lot saved up for there too. Uh, 625 Wisdom uh, Soup, 194 level 4 star uh, soup. So yeah, it's a good way to to save your soup or just to level up your units if you don't want to grind for the soup. Like 
sometimes it is boring grinding for the soup over and over and over again or waiting for the soup because sometimes they don't even have the the certain element that you need like right now they don't have bravery they have the all cups but you're not you're not guaranteed to get a bravery one all the time so yeah it's just another way to level up your new units and uh yeah it's pretty helpful well for me because i've leveled up a whole bunch of my units that i just had sitting there at level five or level six just low level so um yeah if uh if you guys did enjoy this video and if it was helpful and like if you're gonna start doing uh like this method let me know in the comments and uh if it was helpful please leave a like and subscribe and uh thank you guys for watching i appreciate all your support and uh, i'll see you guys in the next video peace